is up fam welcome back to my channel um in today's video i kind of just want to wish you guys a happy new year and just to let you guys know that um i appreciate everybody who's been coming through um leaving me comments liking the videos and watching my videos i really really do appreciate it this year um i finally created my youtube channel i always wanted to do a youtube channel and and i am finally um i finally came about to doing it um it's been something i've always wanted to do and i i'm glad that i finally did it um i am not even gonna lie sometimes i can be a bit of a procrastinator and I had been procrastinating from doing the video for a really long time, but um, I finally did it. And let me just tell you guys, it it feels good when you finally do something that you've always said you're gonna you wanted to do. But I am just completely grateful and thankful for everybody who has been showing me support and showing me love. I'm still trying to figure out. The direction I want my channel to um, go into but I know that um, for one like I do like to entertain um, and I like to share share my life experiences and share things that I go through in life and things like that and if I can be if I can do that and you guys still come through and then that's even cool you know like I don't know. I've always been the one to like to watch um, people's lives. <laughs> I'm that person. <laughs> um, I don't know. And I don't know. But I feel like everybody in this world has a story and has something to share. And so for me, you know, I was like, one day I'll tell you guys my story. Um, but for now, I just want to say thank you so much for all the support, all the love. I really do appreciate it this year. Um, has been a weird one because, you know, who in the world knew or knew that uh, 2020 was going to be like how it is? Um, no, we didn't know. And you know what? I uh, tell my friends that because last year in December, like right now, 31st of last year, 2019, I was sick. And I remember I didn't even make it till 12. And that was my first year that I've ever gotten sick like that to where I didn't make it to um, the countdown. And I was just like, oh my gosh, this is why we're going through this because I didn't stay up and I usually always stay up. <laughs> I was just being uh, funny about it, but I was really sick. And earlier this year in January, I was sick for that whole month of January like I was really like I didn't have a taste for that whole month like I couldn't smell I couldn't taste and I remember like I was like what the heck is wrong with me I was freaking out deep down inside I was kind of freaking out because normally when I get sick I'll go to the doctor and then I'm better and then you know go on about our life <laughs> But this time it lasted for like a month or so. And I was just like, um, nah, we can't be doing this. So I was just trying. I even did a flu test. It came out negative. I was just like, well, then what do I have? I was kind of freaking out. But I tell everybody at work and all my friends, I'm like, I had, I had the Corona. That's why I'm good now. Like, <laughs> and they all laugh about it. But I know that, um, there's a lot of, things that um we go through especially during this time like mentally I know I've gone through a few things myself and I was trying to get focused and I know if I'm struggling with trying to get focused like say I'm um, with my fitness and everything I was struggling and I'm, I'm still struggling but one of my things um in the coming new year that I want to try something different and I want to challenge myself because um, we're only here for a short time. So like do what, if there's things that you want to do and want to accomplish, then make it happen. And that's one thing that I want to do for myself. 
Um, I want to continue my journey in fitness because I'm not even going to lie. I kind of set back a little bit <laughs> on that. I was going through some things and I just was not in the right mindset. And I know you guys can relate whenever you just are in this funk and you really just can't seem to get yourself going. Um, and that's where I have been, to be honest. Like, I'm just like, I'm usually like, whenever I have set my mind to something, like I'm in it and I'm on it. Um, but I, uh, like I lost my focus and it kind of sucks. <laughs> I, I... I was doing so good but and then this pandemic and everything changes a lot of things and changes our mind a little bit and then plus I went through a breakup and all that and that whole relationship I feel like wasn't a good one so that kind of messed with me mentally as well and I just uh it was just I was just not in a good place but now I am I feel so much better I feel alive I feel like I and ready for this new year and I want to do so much more um this year was kind of different but I did get to do a little um I did travel to two new places that I've never been to the first one is Memphis Tennessee which was pretty awesome and then the second one was Vegas um which was pretty cool too um but this coming year I want to do some more traveling um and hopefully this pandemic kind of like chills for a little bit but um yeah I I'm going to work on my fitness I want to challenge myself um to get on a healthier lifestyle and a healthier journey because let me just say the other night I had a little scare and that was like I was just like oh shit <laughs> what is going on here so like I know that like we need to take care of ourselves and the older we get we can't be eating crazy and the things that we used to could eat all the time you know it just doesn't work like that for us anymore so that's what I'm gonna try I'm gonna try to my fitness journey I'm gonna try to get back into the gym I want to eat cleaner I want to change my lifestyle and eating and I want to do more cooking because I can cook, you guys. I can cook. I just don't like to cook. <laughs> and plus, it's just me. So I just, I feel like whenever there's people around, I feel more likely to cook. But when it's just me, I don't. But this new um, fitness journey that I want to embark on, I am going to have to cook. And I think I'll bring you guys with me and you guys can try the new foods that I want to try and um maybe you guys can join me on this journey I just know that motivating each other really helps in doing this and maybe we can build a little community but yeah I want to I want to focus on that this year this coming year next year it sounds so weird to say and see how it goes um with that I already have some ideas I have some recipes I have a plan um what I want to do because once I set my mind to doing it, it's on. It's going to happen. And I, I like, I think that would be something cool to document for myself. And then you guys, and then I can bring you guys with me as well. Because honestly, I like to be athletic. I like to, I don't, I don't, I like doing things. So I like working out, even though sometimes it sucks. <laughs> But I do enjoy the atmosphere. I do enjoy um, being there with my friends and and busting our ass and seeing the results and the accomplishments that go with putting in work. I love that. I just kind of fell off track a little bit, but we all get there. But the thing is, the comeback, the comeback is going to be dope. I know it is. And I'm going to bring you with me. And I'm speaking this into existence because it's going to happen. And... Um, Y'all are going to see. I, one of my goals has been to do a body transformation. I'm a thick girl, but I, um, when I was younger, I was skinny. <laughs> but like, I want, um, I want to do one of those transformation videos where like, 
you're like, damn, she really put in work. Like, a lot of people do surgery and stuff like that, but I ain't about that life because I'm, I'm too much of a chicken shit to um, get under the knife and do all that. Uh-uh. <laughs> I can't do that. <laughs> so I'm going to bust my butt so I can get to where I want to get to. And, yeah, I just want to continue to live life in a positive manner. And just spread positivity and happiness amongst everybody that I surround myself with. Like, I'm a happy person and I want to stay that way. <laughs> Regardless of what's going on, I'm going to choose happy. Have you seen those, those sayings or those shirts? I've seen some that said choose happy. And that's what I want. I want to choose happy, happiness. Um, so... I just want to leave on this note that 2021, regardless of what goes down, just know that you are worth it and you can accomplish anything as long as you set your mind to it. You can do it. And I know... It's hard whenever you hit that little little bump in the road, um, but take time to stop, analyze the situation, think about it, and then get back up and keep moving forward. Cause man, life is hard, you guys. And I know it cause I've been there, still living it. Um, one day I'll tell you guys my story, but yeah, like, I'm here, and, and you know one thing that I've also, um, those that have kids and stuff like that, I know that is hard, but it's also harder for someone that doesn't have kids, because at least you have your kids, and you have them that you're fighting for, you know what I mean, does that make sense, and for a person that doesn't have kids, it's even extra harder, because you don't have anything to like that you can focus your mind on you know does that make sense so for me yeah like I'm like so if you know what I'm trying to say is that for me like I have to just know that God has a plan for me and I have to do it for myself like that's whenever you flip everything and you're like no this is for you. Do it for yourself, nobody else. So I've been living my life. Um, I'm happy for what I have and everything. Um, yeah, it sucks that I don't have that special person in my life. But you know what? Right now, I'm just like, you know what? It, it's not meant to happen right now. I need to focus on the things that I want to do. And that's what I want to do right now with this time this coming year and if it happens it happens but if it doesn't I'm not gonna worry too much about it because stress kills and we don't need to be stressing like that <laughs> um but yeah so uh there's two sides to it I mean everybody has a story so yeah but on that note I just want to tell you guys that I really do appreciate you guys coming through and showing support and love and reach out to me on my Instagram. The description has my information on there. If you have any ideas or if there's anything you want um, to know or if you want me to do a video on something, um, give me ideas. I'm always open for that. Um, Right now, I'm trying to figure out what direction I want to go to. Um, but I know I'll eventually find it. But you know what? Like, doing this, it, it gets more, like, you start getting more used to talking to the camera. And I'm trying to be better at making more eye contact with you guys because it's kind of hard. Um, if you guys never have done this before, you should try it and then you'll be more understanding about it. But it's crazy. Um, I don't know. I like talking to people. Like, I really do. And I can't wait till I reach a thousand subscribers because once I do that, I can I'm able to go live. 
and whenever I can go live, like I can, like I can connect with you guys a whole lot more. So if you guys aren't subscribed, you guys should subscribe because you're helping me out so I could eventually go live and be able to talk to, talk to you guys and be able to connect with you better. So that's one of my goals. Next year, it's going to happen. I know it is. <laughs> but um, yeah, if you guys are feeling down or whatever because of everything that's happened in this new year, it's going to be okay. Keep your head up. It will be okay. Like, it will. I always I always am thankful for um, the mornings when I can wake up and I can see and I can talk and I can move my arms and legs because there's a lot of people that are born without all those things. And to me, like, I'm just thankful. I am just thankful that I'm able to wake up and be able to do a lot of things on my own. I've seen a lot of videos on YouTube and let me just tell you, it's crazy, you know? Sometimes we take things for granted and I don't know. But okay, I'm I'm saying I'm I'm saying so much right now. But thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for coming through, checking me out. Happy New Year. I wanna also tell you that tonight at if you guys are not um doing anything um and if you guys want to join me i'm not sure who else is going to be there but my friend the, um the real new york he's going to have a podcast on um for anybody that's at home and wants to ring in the new year y'all can come through it's like a virtual new year's party um i'll be popping in there on the podcast and it's going to be tonight at 11 i believe is what time he told me so if you guys want to come through come celebrate new year's virtually <laughs> that's crazy huh how we're gonna do it this year but it's okay i'm gonna go to my sister's house i'm gonna spend time with her um the brother-in-law and i don't know maybe my mom might come through but this new year's it's gonna be a chill one and i'm fine with that because I just, I thought about it, like I could go turn up if I want to, but I really don't want to wake up hungover and feeling like shit um, coming in the 2021, like 2021, I don't want to feel like that, I don't, I don't know, so I may have some wine, but I, I just, I'm not gonna, I don't want to wake up like that, so come join in the conversations we're gonna have um but i'll put his link down below if you guys have not checked him out yet come through it's really fun there's a live chat you'll get to see us um live and then we can conversate i don't know what we're gonna be talking about tonight but i'm sure it's gonna get lit we talk about all kinds of stuff last time that i was on there for ladies night it was pretty fun but yeah um, okay, <laughs> I'm gonna leave you with that. Again, thank you, everyone that has come through. Show me support. I really appreciate it. Make sure you click that like button, subscribe. I gotta get better at this. Comment, like, share, subscribe <laughs> if you want. <laughs> but um, two, 2021 is gonna be an even better year. It's gonna be a better year. And I don't know. We're just, we're, we're going to do more. Do more. I've seen that. There's a YouTuber that I watch and he has a tatted on his hand. He has a tatted like right here and he, it says do more. We're going to do more. I'm going to, I'm just, I, yeah, we're going to do more. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys so much. I appreciate all the love. Y'all have no idea. Like, you guys have no idea how much, like, like, even with, like, everybody that is here and watches and, like, comments and that's, like, that makes me so happy and that keeps me going because I'm like, man, okay, cool. You guys are watching. Y'all appreciate what I, what I'm putting out and stuff like that. I don't know.
I appreciate it. But okay, I'm gonna stop. Um, happy New Year. Um, thank you guys. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.